Well, uh, I really my character in, in John Wick is this interesting cat because he straddles both worlds, the good world, the underworld, and the, and he's kind of a good guy, though. He, he has this, you know, car chop shop, which was a, a coolish car, uh, I was going to say Tayyad. It was a cool car club in New York City, which has the top cars in Manhattan. And uh, this guy, you know, he sticks his neck out for his best friend and puts his life in danger, and that's what I liked about Aurelio. What a nice dude. He's such a cool dude. I, I didn't expect that about him. You know, I expected him to be a little more aloof, but he was, he's such a regular bro. Uh, yeah, it, it definitely did. You know, their skills in stunting are, are just, you know, impeccable. But what really stood out for me was how they worked with actors. They really know how to give you your space, how to help you out, know when to leave you alone, know when to come in. It, it was a great experience for me. And working with Alfie was great. The kid from... Uh, uh, Game of Thrones, he was a blast. That scene was so much fun. They can expect some kick-ass action. Like the best action they've seen all year all year long. I mean, you got sequences that are really long, really thought out, really meticulously uh, executed. You're going to see a lot of crazy cars, a lot of 84 kills, some of the most kills in any movie you've ever seen, and, and great fighting and great acting. I mean, you got Ian McShane, you got... Willem Dafoe, you got Alfie, you got me, you got Keanu, tops.